Okay, so I'm here with LFC and Jack Wilson, where they're just about to take a headline the bring in Liverpool. So I'm going to ask them, just explain to everyone who you are first. Okay. Uh, we are a pop duo from Liverpool. Um, I'm, I'm the singer. <laughs> I'm the singer. I'm and the rapper. I'm the rapper and we just do our thing. Yeah, we do our thing. We do. Okay, so how did you guys meet? Ooh. Yeah, because actually um, it was kind of a nice, a nice feeling for how we met from yeah. anyway. Because I put a music video on YouTube. I used to be a solo rapper, and Jack what, happened to go to the same college as me. And he we kinda, same he, classes though. Yeah. No, no. He kind of seen me on the street and was like, "I knew that one on YouTube." <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah, we just spoke on Facebook, got in touch, yeah. we went out, become best of friends like overnight. We didn't really do anything like musical wise at first though. No, definitely we we, we thought it would be better to get to know each other. No, it was it, it was like when we when we first did yours we uploaded a video and we yeah. happened to be a bit drunk. Yeah. <laughs> we was a bit drunk. We did get had a bit of a laugh. We did get a lot of laughs on off it like a lot of likes on Facebook, so we thought this could be a thing. This could be like But we didn't realise that it was gonna be music. No, wise. we didn't, we didn't and what happened was obviously Jack sings, I rap, and we wrote a song together. We were just like messing with one, and we actually thought this could be a good track. We got it recorded in like my house, didn't we? Yeah. <laughs> my house, and it went well. It went well. And yeah, that's how it started. Just kicked off from there. Oh, that was a reason in the night. It was crazy. What? So, right to the top was your first single. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. What was the inspiration behind that? I don't think there really was an inspiration. It was just like. We no we celebration of our friendship because yeah. it's me and my bro. We, so we were it's trying like to that get call it right to yeah, the top. yeah exactly. We want to go to the top hopefully one day. And yeah, that, that was the inspiration. Just us two being friends, having a laugh, and it was very cheeky and catchy, and it worked. So yeah, we're grateful for that. And then your second single was Let's Fly High, oh, yeah. which people would really work in for. Yeah, for that took a lot of planning. It did, it took a lot of planning, we had to change the lyrics, we had to even go to, we entered we the competition, to it started didn't it, when we entered the competition, went to the top, and we already had that fly high written, and we had to get the beat off my cousin, actually, my cousin made the beat didn't yeah. for us, we went up to London, we won the competition with Shake Away, you know Shake Away, Nestle, Olympus, three massive companies, and it was amazing. It was amazing. Right to the top actually won that. Yeah, right to the top won, with four and a half thousand votes, and then we went to... London to film the video and it was unbelievable. Yeah. No, did I say video? Yeah. London to record the song. We've done the song and then we've done, done the video. Done the video in Liverpool. <laughs> I'm sure it's not the other box in Liverpool. Yeah, so. How long did the video take for Let's Fly High? It took a full day. It took a full day. Well, it took like yeah. a lot of sh shooting. I was just like, <laughs> <laughs> at the uh, end of the day, it was like, it was like, head. Yeah, it was like, it was, free, it was a day when it was freezing yeah, cold. Yeah. And you know what, like, love to the mad heads, our fans, for actually coming out that day. There was like 50 and yeah. turned up at 10 in the morning. But it was like freezing cold and we had to do sh sh like, just clips of like, of us just in a t-shirt and oh, it was really Literally cold. Literally my like, nipples were hard, <laughs> it was that cold. It was, it was like really cold. Yeah, well, it was freezing. It was a good day though, yeah, amazing, good. amazing. So we're going to go on to some fan questions now. Oh, yeah, you kind yeah. of just touched this one, right? But this one... Is <laughs> um, ask them why you chose to call your fans the Maddox. That was from Blue and You and wow. Connor Lynch. I think we already know that because they're all They're crazy, the mad. What basically? Yeah, 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 like that's our fans that's right there screaming. Yeah, that, that's our Right, so what happened was me and him do mad videos, as you know, yeah. we get love for it, and all the fans love that, and then they kind of respond to us in ways, so we just think, well, they must be mad too. So we just thought, mad heads, it's a good name. We're mad, as you know. Yeah, we're just crazy. Doesn't like to do it to the top. Um, Jess Jones asked, if they could do something with all their fans for one day, what would it be and why? You answer one, I'll answer one. That's yeah, sorry, you say that again. He said, if, if you could do something with your fans for a day, what would it be and why? <laughs> Okay, speak up loud. Yeah. Do you want me to go first? No, yeah. I'd, uh, I'd love to do another music video and get them all in it again. Definitely, that's a good idea actually. Yeah. Yeah. If it was possible. Yeah. What I would like to do actually, I have this idea and it's most of the management's wanted. All our fans have been waiting for merchandise to be launched. Yeah. 
and I said a merchandise launch would be good. So, so I'm actually going to have their own one today. Exactly, like, thank you, by the way. If all of them have got the tops done today, you'll see this video and be like, that was me. Yeah, so I was looking to do a merchandise launch where we can celebrate the launch of our merchandise. Yeah. Whatever we could come, we do is get pictures and buy our stuff. So that was just double what I'd do. I'd like to see them. Oh, just a day where they can come to a building and see us and buy our, buy our merchandise as well as the yeah. tools. Well, obviously, what well, they need to do is the gigs from the big guys on the Yeah, of course. But yeah, I would, I would just like to spend the whole day with them. Yeah. Just having a laugh and getting to know them in a way. It's hard to get to know them because so many of them want to talk to us. And sometimes I feel bad on the ones that don't get to. Because yeah. you get shy ones, even though the man. We still have a shy side to so feel bad sometimes. We love this all so much. So we love them all equally. Chloe wrestles and why are you so busy? Thank you, Chloe. Um, <laughs> it's our wish, guys. It is. Yeah. <laughs> We, do, we just love to be happy and inspire people. I think that's why you think we're amazing. You just, you just see us happy all the time. It's just like one big happy yeah. band. Yeah, it's because of you, it is. It's because of our fans. Yeah, but, it, yeah, but it is at points where you, where you obviously have experienced different things like that. Oh, that's all. And you know, we all understand that everybody's going to like music. Everybody's yeah. like Everyone music. gets hate. Everyone gets hate. Yeah. It seems as though. When, so, when somebody says something bad on a video, or if somebody says something bad on a stage that they do, you've yeah. always got like, I know you compare to people that's back up that we can so, so it seems like they're just getting back up. You know what, we have a, like, the love, support, dedication, time they spend every single day. Even like, it's just little things like when, when they just like pop up to you saying, oh my god, you're so amazing, or stuff like that, it just makes you feel like, yeah. it makes, makes you feel dead. Like, 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 people buy us umbrellas with the trailer. Yeah. That's what the lot of them might be sick. Things, but that's just showing you gratitude. Yeah, really is. Yeah. 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 Okay, right, um, I'll answer the number and then you can answer that. Um, my nan, the reason why she still is my number one man, she was there from the start when no one was there for me. Obviously that's none of my fans fault because they didn't know me, but she was there from the start, so, so she is. So you're not pushed you to get into Yeah, she was. She, she kinda, I, I pushed myself, but she was kind of there for me as well and she supported it more than anyone, I'll admit that she did. More than Because I didn't know Kay or Jack. I was literally on my own and my nan was the only yeah. one kind of behind me saying you'll get there one day on your music, it's so inspiring and people very, will realise she's very, she's supportive, very inspirational and supportive as well yeah, yeah. even to Jack, she, she treats Jack as a second man so, so yeah, love thanks, you, love, love, you, love, love you, you and thanks for that question by the way, made me think <laughs> and the last one, what can we expect to see from you in the future? BIG! <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, obviously, I just want to be known on everything. We want to be known on everything. I, I wish I could. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we want to be UK famous, I'd say. We'd like to be UK famous, wouldn't we? Oh, no. We do want to be world famous. Yeah, of course, but we're just thinking realistically, yeah, yeah in the UK. UK yeah. famous, and then we'll expand it. I think yeah. me and Jack would like to actually die for a minute and then come back alive. Yeah, but if you did want to know what's coming from us, we actually have. This is our headline gig now, 26 of April. We're alive, we're alive. We're alive. Thanks for the interview, by the way. And we've got more coming up. We've got Connor Harris. Connor Harris, gig 30th. He's actually here today. The O2 Academy 30th of August. Don't forget. Don't forget, which is the 26th or 28th. I'll leave all the links in the description. We'll get all the details put on the link, so look for them. You can come and support us. You can also just go buy tickets for them as well. Yeah, and also you can see our brand new summer song coming out. Yeah. Um, it's a choice between. Well, you going to do it tonight? Actually, it's going to be a live decision tonight. So it's one. You're the first to know that. So we will so we'll record that from the stage. Yeah. That live, de live decision tonight whether they want to see Party Town or, or Make Wish for Summer Town. Come on first. And then we're going to do an encore tonight of what's happening over there. Make sure that. So. And if you've got one message to give back to each of you, what would it be? From me, thank you for supporting.
all of us, all the time, and always showing us love and love to our kids, everything so much. And we just love you all. Yeah, right, so honestly, every day, right, I can look on my phone and whether I'm upset, happy, sad, moody, angry, there's always a fan there and it'll make me smile straight away. So thank you for that, all you see so much, okay? Love you all. We love you, just keep doing what you're doing, because that's what keeps us where we are today. Thank you. Yeah.